which news personalities or organizations truthfully covered the shooting versus the fake news reporters or organizations? Fox News was the only one that reported carefully. To add more to that, I would say Sean Hannity himself was the only person that reported the truth at the time, which was that everyone knew nothing until the trial. And I thank him for that. All righty. Um, which lying mainstream media outlet do you think is the worst or hate the most? Well, hate is a strong word, but I would say CNBC. And they why is that? Most. Sorry for jumping the gun. jumping the gun on that one. They lied the most, and they gainfully employed Al Sharpton, who's done nothing but exploit people. All right. Um, how has your political outlet changed in the past five years, and why? My political outlet? Your po political outlook. Well, I trust that Mr. Trump will do the right thing. All right. And has that changed? Has that moved from another position? No, sir. I've heard from several good friends of mine that he's the right man for the job to make sure that America is great again. Terrific. Um, how have your family and faith helped you in the face of malicious prosecution and the mainstream media's campaign against you? You've heard the old saying about telegraph. Um, my family and friends tell the truth. And Angela Corey is no longer a prosecutor in the state of Florida. And for that, I thank God. All right. Um, if you were president, how would you solve the black crime epidemic? I would ask for more mentors to go where they're needed because I mentored and I know for a fact it made a difference. But nobody wants to ask those kids. All right. Um, what do you think of Steve Bannon being a neo-reactionary monarchist? I don't know what that word means. All right. Uh, neo-reactionary is... Uh, well, neo-reactionary would take too long to explain. A monarchist is somebody who... Uh, uh, I, I think that, to put this question in English, how do you feel about Steve Bannon wanting... Uh, there to be a monarchy in the United States. I haven't done enough research to give that a one-word answer. I hope and pray almost daily that Mr. Trump will do the right thing because we the people elected him to be the leader. All right. Um, do you wish... You were there to protect the cops who were killed in Dallas last year. I hope I'm very clear. Yes. All right. Will you start a George Zimmerman branded bodyguard service with me? Asks one of the askers. <laughs> sure. All right. Uh, can you clear up all the media misinformation from your run-ins at local bars where they claimed you made racist remarks? Yes. Unfortunately, there are drunks everywhere in this world. Some of them go to the bar to drink. And when they call me slurs, epithets, whatever you want, whatever they want to say about me, I stand up and ask them to step outside. Now, if that starts a fight, shame on them. Okay. Um, so, do, um, so did you make uh, racist remarks? No. Okay. Um, when you were going to write a book or make a documentary, 
Uh, oh, when are you going to write a book or make a documentary with Don West about the truth of your malicious prosecution? Whenever Don West wants to. All right. Well, that is the end of all the questions, George. Um, is there anything else that you'd like to tell the researcher audience today? God bless you all. And thank you for everything. Terrific, George. Thank you very much.